Tommy, unfortunately, that's that pretty good little winning run we had to come to an end. What do you think went wrong out there today? Well, I don't think we did enough to win the game. Um, I thought Dorgan came out the traps better than us, a bit more fired up than us, I think. Uh, a little bit more rudimentary than I thought they would play. I thought they'd play a bit more, but listen, you can't knock them. They got their noses in front and we were indebted to Geordie to, to not be more than 1-0 down. As has been the case lately, we seem to have, you know, we regroup at half time. We have, you know, honest words, but not nothing overly you know, critical, it's just, look lads, you've got to get, that's gone. We can't be that bad again, and it's, it's only 1-0. So we, we knew we were going to have a spell, and we did. We came out and responded, got ourselves back in the game. But again, it's it's disappointing because every point in this division should be absolutely cherished. And, and I, I don't think some of our lads understand that yet. Um, there's been a lot of noise, not from inside the dressing room, but from outside the dressing room, from media people, giving them loads of pats on the backs and well dones, and I'm sick of it. You know, we'll do that in we'll do that in April, whenever the season finishes, you know. It's a work in progress. It's a game Saturday, a game Tuesday, a game Saturday. Let's get to the end of every Saturday and then assess. And you know, people can have their opinions about who's good, who isn't good, but ultimately we as a group have just not done enough today to win a football match. Too much noise for me between the two clubs. I don't give a monkeys about who worked here and who worked there. It's got nothing to do with anything, and that's too much noise about that for me. This is a football match. There's, I could give you excuses, but I'm not that type of bloke. There's reasons I think we didn't play particularly well today. There was a team that I had to pick because of certain conditions of other players. So, you know, I know the full story. Until everybody knows that, then I would like them to keep their opinions to themselves. We fell behind again, obviously, the last two times that's happened. That It was fine, we got back into it, we got the three points. But today, we just couldn't quite do that. Is that a bit of a worry, falling behind again? It's disappointing to fall behind, but I've got to say, for all... The fact that I was disappointed with myself, you look at the two goals that took massive deflections to go in the goal. You know, I think Geordie saves both, both if, if they're not touched by the initial straight towards the goal. So, you know, that's picking its straws, I suppose. But, it, but ultimately, over the 90 minutes, we could have probably eked a draw out of it, but I don't think we, we did enough on the ball. We didn't play well enough. And I said off after the game on Tuesday night, I trade off some of it, our... our lack of ultimate defensive duties because we dominate the ball but we didn't do that today so that's not an excuse that's a fact we've been fairly privileged so far this season where we haven't had too many defeats so is it going to be interesting to see the character of the group and, and reacting to that defeat this week yeah i mean that's all we can do we, you know we can only put it to the side like we like we always do whether we win lose or draw move on to the next game sure as eggs is eggs it's a tougher task next week than anything we're going to get in this division so if we if we turn up like we did today it'll be a very short afternoon and we won't be doing that the, num the numbers that have traveled today are fantastic and we really appreciate that and we 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 wanted to give them something to go home happy with and we nearly did but i'm 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 frustrated more than anything else because the same group of people, you know, know that my message to them is consistent Monday to Friday and I expect them to be consistent on a Tuesday and a Saturday. And today I just think we we haven't reached the levels that we've we've put there as our standards and lads lads have got to take that on the chin. Not me and the staff. we we've, we've not changed. They have their output's been different. As you say there, you know, your message is the same. We, we, we've had plenty of discussions before and after games where we said, you know, it's we're just focusing on the next game now. So it's business as usual this week, isn't it? Absolutely. Like I said, we've got to get, we've got to treat winning and losing as this, what they are. They're just part of the week. It's not in the rules that you can't lose a football match. Sometimes who you lose to and reasons behind that can be a little bit more meaningful to certain people in a the football club but you know we've got to be able to handle things that you know noise we've got to be able to handle that and ultimately um i look forward to the next game like i said it's a free hit for us swindon our football league club who've played in the premier league actually and um we'll go there and i, I hope we express ourselves in a manner that gives us a really good representation of all the short time because today first half first half we just we weren't at the races um 